Um, I'm Steve Cello. Um, I work out in the Department of Economics at the University of Zambia. I've been working there since, I think, 2002. And um, mainly what we do in the Department of Economics is do a lot of social and economic research. I coordinate a program called the Health Economics Research and Training Program. And within that program, mainly we do policy analysis in health and um, also research and training in health, very specifically um, on health-related issues. Um, we have been working with various organizations, and very recently we have started to work with the Center for Global Development out in Washington in the U.S. And um, with the Center for Global Development, our main focus has been to understand um, issues around HIV AIDS and, and um, the support that is coming to HIV AIDS from the different um, bilateral and multilateral partners to Zambia. Uh, within that context, um, um, we find relevance in, in doing the whole HIV AIDS analysis, um, policy understanding, um, understanding of the different influences because um, HIV AIDS um, is one of the most significant burdens to the Zambian economy. Um, out of every four or five people, you find one person who will have HIV AIDS, and that's a very strong statistic. If you talk to people generally, you will not find anyone out in the street who has not experienced HIV AIDS in terms of somebody either being affected by HIV AIDS or somebody being actually infected or having died of HIV AIDS. So fundamentally, this is a problem for the economy, for families, for households, for individuals. And uh, within that respect, I think we think we can make a fundamental difference if we can harmonize and coordinate or influence the coordination and harmonization of support that's coming to HIV AIDS. It is definitely obvious that a lot of people in Zambia and out of the country are really interested in making a meaningful contribution to how the whole problem is tackled. And really the question is, how do we best tackle this to make sure that the limited resources available out there make the biggest impact for these different families, individuals, for even the government that are trying to contend with this huge issue that we call HIV AIDS. So it is from that point of view that we find a strong relevance to work with the Center for Global Development to make sure that our research goes out and it reaches the right people in Washington, reaches the right people regionally, um, and reaches the right people in government, in the National AIDS Council in Zambia, in uh, the Ministry of Health, just making sure that these people actually listen to what we're saying and take on board some of the recommendations because they are recommendations that we feel will be coming from the people that are everyday experiencing the difficulties of living with HIV AIDS.